Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about the Vanguard PPSH here in Warzone. One thing about the Vanguard PPSH, I only think it's only good as a headfire build. Like, legit. If you guys think I'm wrong, man, legit, tell me down in the comment section below. But I think 100% the number one class setup for the Vanguard PPSH is only good as a headfire build. I got as a fire gameplay, man, with the Vanguard PPSH. Even got a crazy rebirth solo win. You guys, of course, must sit back and just watch. And before we do our brand today's gameplay for it, man, just drop a like. Hit the subscribe button, guys, are brand new. Give me guys feedback down in the comment section and always remember to do is hit that bell icon for the brand new videos we post on our channel guys do not want to mess out on the best setups and of course the fire gameplay that will be provided for you guys now let's get right into today's gameplay for it of course right I'm so glad that I did not get finished. Bring on the airstrike. This is Phoenix Three, strike inbound. Wait, I see, just got a kill from that. Hostile dropping into the air. Good effect on target. Supply box located. Move to secure. <laughs> Bounty target has been marked. End them. I don't even have enough, so we can't even get load out just yet. I might have to get that guy out of the game. He were my hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Yep. All right, good. All right, we got him out the game. Good, 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 good. He might have been the one that's probably going to probably have issues with. But if he is, we did. We did a good deed. We did a good deed. Got a little motherfucker out the game. Same man, listen, anytime that you guys see somebody sweaty, bud, just get them out the game. There's no Enemy point of trying to keep active. them in the game. Talking about meet Enemy them to the end. Nah. Like, because I ain't about to do that. Because I, I know he was holding that angle in this, in that building. Enemy dropping into the AO. Take care, Bounty. Contract time expired. The target's been lost. Enemy UAV. I say, I oh, wait. Okay. Oh, nope. Okay. I don't have no money for anything. But I don't know where the rest of this lobby's at. Loadout drop headed your way. It seemed like to me, like, it's just all, all over the place. is closing in. Relocating the safe zone. I don't know like where I should go. Dude, I'm acting like this is my first time playing solos. What's the plan? Okay, you know what? My fault, my fault, my fault. I might have wasted like so much time. Dude, this lobby's getting torched.
Cause I don't even know like where to like look at. Okay, I had somebody up top of me. Like, am I gonna find somebody or hello? Dude. Ah, okay. All right. Dude, I haven't found nobody in a cool little minute. Am I stuck on? Not even a buy station over here. Enemy UAV active. That guy's still AFK. Gas is moving in. You say like, I legit like just cannot find nobody for like the whole entire minute. I was like, where the hell is everybody? I couldn't find nobody. I ain't gonna lie, I mean, like, listen. Like, if we get a gameplay this, this actually probably be good, because, <laughs> like, lobbies have actually been, like, a little bit chalk. Enemy UAV active. I don't even know where the guy even killed him at. Hello? UAV is out of fuel. Returning for a Motherfucker was sitting in the corner. Yes, I said, like, where the fuck is this guy at? Enemy soldier nearby. Enemy team is tracking your position. Supply box located. Move to secure. I see might be a trap. Enemy soldier nearby. 
No, somebody just robbed my kill. You've made it to the top ten. Gas is moving in. New safe zone highlighted. Get back in there. Oh! Oh my god, I could not see that kid. Gas is inbound. Bounty target is up. Take him down. I did not see that kid. Precision airstrike nest. Enemy cluster strike. Gas is moving in. New safe zone highlight. You're losing ground. Move it. I feel like he's just gonna die to storm anyway. Yeah, he died to storm. Yep. Okay, so I hope you guys did enjoy today's video, man, with the Vanguard PPSH. Now I'm going to be breaking down this the class setup for you guys to just get you guys right for the perfect setup for the gun. Now, for the muzzle, 100%, you guys should be rocking is, of course, your recoil booster, which actually just help us with your plus fire rate. For the barrel, you guys should be rocking is the second barrel, which actually just help us with your all the hip fire accuracy, and that's to give you is your plus fire rate, such as your recoil recovery. Now, for the optic, 100%, I was actually was rocking is your, of course, is your slight reflector it really doesn't matter what type of optic you guys want to use but i think 100 percent is no necessarily needed since you're going to be hit firing all the time um the stock 100 percent you guys should be rocking this of course with your remove stock which just help us with your hit fire accuracy movement speed and of course help us with your sprint of fire now coming down to the perk section it's up to you guys but of course for me i like that rockers of course is tight grip most of the time most of the people actually with rockers of course is nervous still since actually this type of it is of course with your accuracy and your recoil while getting injured but of course after the update i still think just the tight grip perk is still going to be the best for the gun now perk to 100 percent you guys be as quick for your sprint the sprint speed i think 100 percent this actually will be the best perk setup for the ppsh now coming down to the rear grip it's 100 i'm not gonna lie you guys just gotta rock as a pine tar grip which just help us with your recoil control and of course help us with your head by accuracy don't really worry about your adsb since majority of the time you're going to be head firing with it magazine 100 percent you guys be rocking is the nambu 71 round magazine which just help us with your recoil control your accuracy and of course actually just help us with your plus fire rate now coming up to the ammunition i think 100 percent this actually is going to be is a little bit different but i think you guys should be rocking support is your frangible perk which is, does help us with your wounding um like hitting i guess i think it's just hitting from anywhere and near the limbs and especially from just any type of spot it actually does help out with with the enemy with having like it's a slow movement speed which i think 100 percent is actually going to be the best one most of the time i would actually recommend this of course is your hollow point but this is actually just going to be hitting from anywhere from the limb and especially from the torso anywhere up 
is I think 100% frangible is going to be your best one. And then for the underbarrel, I 100% think you guys should be rocking the course. It's your carbon foregrip, but it just helps to recoil control and hit fire accuracy. So we do copy down the setup. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.